Good morning and grace and peace to you from God our Father and our Lord Jesus the Christ. Amen. The reading I'm sharing with you this morning is for this coming Sunday, the fifth Sunday of Easter, and it's a portion of our second reading, and it's from 1 John chapter 4, verses 12 through 21. No man has seen God at any time. If we love one another, God dwelleth in us, and his love is perfected in us. Hereby we know that we dwell in him and he in us, because he hath given us his spirit. And we have seen and do testify that the Father sent the Son to be the Savior of the world. Whosoever shall confess that Jesus is the Son of God, God dwelleth in him, and he in God. And we have known and believed the love that God hath to us. God is love, and he that dwelleth in love dwelleth in God, and God in him. Herein is our love made perfect, that we may have boldness in the day of judgment, because as he is, so are we in this world. There is no fear in love, but perfect love casteth out fear, because fear hath torment. He that feareth is not made perfect in love. We love him because he first loved us. If a man say, I love God, and hateth his brother, he's a liar. For he that loveth not his brother whom he hath seen, how can he love God whom he hath not seen? And this commandment have we from him, that he who loveth God love his brother also. Here ends the reading. Now, perfect love does cast out fear. It casts it out because we trust the one that we love. And who can we possibly trust more than God, our creator, God, our redeemer, God, the spirit who abides in us and whose love abides in us. We love God. We love others because God first loved us and that he died and gave himself so that we might be forgiven our sins and reconciled to him now and forever. Let us pray. Heavenly Father, send now your Holy Spirit upon us that you might abide in us and we in you. Fill us with your spirit of love. Fill us with the spirit of Christ. Amen.